it, let you go along. Yes, sir. And it also showed me that I can go and beat anything that comes my way, and you know, I'm very strong. This is the fun part, you know. It's a week-long camp to remind kids they're not alone. You know, to see a child with tubes hanging out of his chest flexing like a strong man, it'll change your life. It really will. Yeah. They're safe here. They're everything's normal here for them. And From water activities to scavenger hunts, campers at Camp Rappahope are promised a good time. Snow cones, popcorn. This is 11-year-old Noah Jackson's fifth year here. He loves the water. A uh, water fruit uh, because it's just more, more free than you're not closed in. It's a week full of fun for children diagnosed with cancer or those who are recovering from the disease. I got diagnosed with cancer when I was going to the fourth grade. It was the second day of school. I took chemo and I had another one in my stomach, but I got that one out too. All week long, it's a chance for them to just be a kid and forget about the hospital visits and tests. For Assistant Director Ross Dorsett, it's her calling. It is, yes, yeah. This is, this is where the Lord has me, that's for sure. To serve these kids um, is really, it's exactly what I'm supposed to do. I do know that. Organizers say kids build friendships with others that share the same story. I packed like two weeks before it was camp time. You sure you don't want to go home from here? No. <laughs> Stay here forever. <laughs> Wishes that it will be longer, like two weeks or to a month.